Okay, so I'm just going to go through putting notes against a time entry and how that shows up in Workflow Max. Now, you'll notice on the left here, I've got the mobile version open, okay, uh, just, to, just so I can show you through adding the time in on that and adding the note on that. And we're just going to go through that now. So I'm going to hit enter time, uh, enter the date, remembering I can go back up to a week. Uh, ideally, obviously, you would enter your timesheets every day. The job, I'm going to put it against the Adrian Rocky Coffee House job and it's come through with the task that I'm completing as well. I'm going to put three hours on it here. Uh, and my notes here that I'm going to write, I'm going to write uh, sample works included for this time period. Okay, and I'm going to hit save on that. So once that's in there, uh, we can have a look at it in Workflow Max as in the desktop, I guess, version of it. So looking at the desktop screen here, I'm going to jump into a couple of different ways of seeing that note against the time. So first way is going through the jobs section and having a look at the job. So looking at it by a job by job basis. So obviously you can see this consulting has started to track up towards its estimated 10 hours. Uh, there'll actually be two timesheet entries in against this. So if I go to the timesheet tab just here and I scroll down, I can see the two, uh, two examples that I've put in there. So you can see both of them say, this is the task I'm working on, this is the label that I'm working on, the same on each one. And then obviously this, is, this here is the note that I've just entered. Uh, so you can see it on a timesheet entry basis. So each entry gets its own note. And we can do that by job. Okay, so that's doing it via the job screen. You can also do it through the timesheet function. So if you go through business, business and timesheets and have a look at Gary Jukes, the employee, I can actually see the two different uh, timesheet entries that we've put in there with their individual notes against them. Okay, so there's two ways, obviously, you can get those notes out. Uh, and it's important to have those notes in so you can go back in and have a look and see exactly what was done uh, during each time entry period. If you have any questions on this, obviously uh, get in contact with us and we can uh, explain it in a bit more detail if needed. Thanks.